everyone. Stephanie Adams, Chief Empowerment Officer with WNY People Development with the second installment of our Team Tips Leader Series. Now, anyone that knows anything about me knows that I am all about celebrations. Um, it's important as humans, we all just want to be seen and not just seen, we also want to be valued. So celebrating simple things is incredibly important and can be a huge boost for team morale. Now, I know that, you know, organizations do big recognition ceremonies, typically like once a year or maybe twice a year. And they look at, you know, a product launch or they look at great sales numbers. But being able to highlight some of the small things that go on day to day on our teams really goes a long way with building that team cohesion and, and can just make things fun. And, and it's all about trying to build a culture of recognition and respect, right? So today's team tip is all about celebration. And celebration in a very simple way, team awards. This is something that you should be doing weekly or bi-weekly, but it's not about you, the leader, giving the awards to your team members. It's about team members celebrating each other, seeing the things that they do, recognizing the greatness that somebody brings to the room or into the team meeting. It could be really fun awards, the out of the weeds award. Maybe you were working on a project and you had that one team member that really helped pull everybody together and made it happen. So that one is a great idea. Um, you know, the cheerleader award. I am always that smile in the morning and so many people have told me that that has turned around their day. So if you have that person on your team, highlight that. Thank them for being that smile that gets you going and motivated. Um, it could be something as simple as the Clear Communication Award. Maybe you've been working on something and there was a lot of confusion going on in the team and one team member put it all into an email and it made sense and, and you know, eliminated the confusion. Highlight those simple things. Then there's also the fun ones, you know, best hallway dancer, right? Who makes the best coffee on the team? Bring some fun into your team and celebrate each other. If I'm trying to build team cohesion, we've talked a lot about that you need relationships and trust. If I'm able to celebrate you, I'm showing that I appreciate working with you. I respect you as an individual and as a professional. And not only do I respect you, but I'm gonna celebrate you for the great things that you bring to this team. So team tip for today, team awards. Have some fun with them. And if you wanna get super creative, give out the certificates. I don't care how old you are, everyone loves to get a recognition. And I can tell you on teams that I've had before, whether it was with students or C-suite executives, when you hand over that certificate for the Clear Communication Award or Best Coffee Maker Award, it's gonna make somebody smile and it's gonna help build that relationship with members of your team. So team awards, give it a shot. Why not you?